Good morning, YouTubers. This is uh, maybe a little off topic, but I'm still in the anthem. It's still rolling. It's got 219,000 miles on it. And as I've been saying all the time, I haven't had an issue with it. Uh, I'm currently in uh, Decatur, Illinois. I hear them say they got a truck driver shortage. I can uh, believe that. Because uh, I'm getting up in, up in age, as they say, long in the tooth. And um, I had the hardest time passing my little DOT physical. You know, I actually had to take off like five weeks to get squared away and lose some weight and all this kind of stuff. And it's genetics, and my dad had hypertension and uh, diabetes and all that kind of stuff. But it makes me realize that I'm getting older and I need to uh, take better care of myself. And we all know it's hard to eat healthy out here on the road. Did you know that the Subway subs, and as this may be, like I said, off topic, the subs on the Subway, you think they're healthy. I ate a bunch of those, right? Well, the bread in the Subway sub is made from the same thing as cotton candy. They just take the sweetness out of it. But it's actually sugar. They spin the bread in a Subway sub out of sugar. So when you eat in the sub, you think you're eating fresh and healthy. The bread in the sub, if you even if you get the wheat bread, is made out of the same substance as cotton candy. So I just wanted to tell you guys, you know, you're getting over the age of 50 as I am, you gotta pay more attention to your health. Try to quit smoking keep your weight down but anyway it's also getting hard to find somewhere to park at night if you don't get parked by five o'clock four o'clock you are through you see them parked on the shoulder on the get on ramp you know why that is because i run late in these places i go to they keep you too late or whatever the case may be and uh end up having nowhere to park at the park on shoulders and such but as far as the anthem goes it has and still is amazing I had the overhead done on it at 200,000 miles and it actually picked up a lot of fuel mileage the uh, power definitely came back and um it's been a good truck. Tires are still good. I had to replace one on the driver's side because it was, was cupping out real bad. Had a couple of little pieces missing out of it, but ain't no telling what that was. But the truck's been fine. I need to polish it up, I know. It's, uh, I wanted to show you a little tag I bought for it. You know, I named the truck Snoopy. And, uh... I named the truck Snoopy. So I put a tag on it. So if you see Snoopy, you know that's me. I'll be around... Up and down the highway. This is what I do until they stop giving me DOT physicals. I gotta work on my health. I think running the road has gotten unhealthy for me. I'm gonna try and talk to my little terminal guy and see can I get something that gets me through the house as often as possible because when I'm home, I can stick to a, uh, I can stick to a schedule. Stay on top of my weight eat healthier foods and what have you but 
anyway Mac's been fine I like to find somebody to tent the side windows it's been running great better fuel mileage and uh, I just try to make sure I find fuel that's not a um, bio that bio fuel that's not good for it and it, it'll show you if you pay attention to your truck like I do <clears throat> but I can't think of one issue if I had with it you know it's just routine maintenance uh, still got the same drive tires on it like I said I replaced the steer tire on the passenger side the one on the driver's side it's the, it's the factory tire but I'm getting ready to put some on it sooner or later but they still got a lot of miles on it so Mac Anthem 2019 Snoopy is still running great uh, not one issue guys I don't Mac makes a great product it really does not one issue now I did have a problem with the hood the uh, rods and some rods that run here these make the hood easy to open one of them slid out and that hood probably it was almost impossible to open it you could open it but you have to open it from the side <coughs> so but I figured out that that rod that slid one of those rods that slid out and I put it back in the hole and just tapped it back in there and it's a it's a little nut that tightens down a little bolt that screws in there and locks it in and tighten that back up and the hood started opening easy like it used to and those things are they're spring loaded but uh other than that no issue at all today's july 29th year is 2021 I got a grandson on the way. I got to try to do something to try to hang around a little more. But, uh, yep, the anthem's still here. I tried to keep it clean. I got it washed yesterday because uh, it was filthy from sitting for five weeks. But uh, other than that, the old truck's still good. So you guys be good, be safe, and take care of your health. It's Chance. <laughs>